Hey guys, I was tagged um, by Emily at Emily's Interest to do a TMI tag and I'm really excited to do this because I love uh, watching tag videos so I thought it'd be really cool to make my own tag video. So I hope you enjoy. So the first question is, what are you wearing? Um, I'm wearing this short sleeve zebra top with jeans and slippers. Um, the next question is, have you ever been in love? Um, no, I've never been in love. I've ever had a terrible breakup? Oh, I've never actually had a boyfriend, so I have not been in a position to have a terrible breakup. How tall are you? I am 5'7". How much do you weigh? Um, that's classified. Any tattoos? Yes, I have a tattoo on the back of my right shoulder. Um, it's the Chinese characters for sister. Do you have any piercings? Yes, I have these piercings and I have another piercing on top. Um, but I never wear earrings anymore in um, my top piercings. Um, question 8, OTP. I don't actually know what that means. Um, so I'll go on to the next uh, question. Question nine: What is your favorite show? I watch way too much TV. I have a lot of favorite shows. Um, I really, really loved House, and it was really too bad that they quit making House episodes. Same with CSI Miami and CSI New York. I really loved those shows, and I was really sad when they stopped. I really like Master Chef. I watched all the seasons. I like Grey's Anatomy. I know there are so many more shows that I like. Favorite bands? I like Hillsong United, Casting Crowns. Mm. And then there's another um, musician who I really, really like. I think his name is Chris Rice. I forget. Um, but I really like his songs. I haven't listened to any of his songs in a long while. Um, question 11, something you miss. Um, as much as I would never want to return to my childhood years, I kind of miss not having responsibilities. It's kind of nice not being a grown-up. Um, favorite song? Oh, I really like that new song by Taylor Swift. I don't know what it's called. It's like, haters gonna hate, 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 hate. Players gonna play, 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 play. That one? I like that one. Anyway. Um, how old are you? I am 25. Zodiac sign, I am a Leo. 15, quality you look for in a partner. Um, definitely honesty, and not just being honest with me, but it's really important to me that um, my boyfriend or husband or whoever is like an honest person all around, doesn't lie to other people. Um, also, he has to be a little outgoing to compliment my not outgoingness. Um, he has to have a lot of integrity. Like he has to be a man of his word. He has to do what he says he's gonna do. And if he makes mistakes, like he has to be able to own up to them. Like to me, like that's what a real man does. Um, favorite quote. Oh, I really, really like this quote and it's, it's my favorite quote. So it's strange that I don't know like the exact words, but it's something about um, uh, like be kind to everyone because everyone is like fighting a battle of their own or something like that. Um, I'll try to find that quote for you guys. Actually, I try to live by that every day. Um, and even when like I'm not treated well by like someone at a, who's helping me at a store or or like the barista at Starbucks, if they're not like the most polite people in the world, like I try not to like get bothered by that and I still try to like smile and be polite to them because I just I remind myself like they could be going through something really tough um, that I'll never know about but um, maybe my smile will somehow help them have like a better day um, and yeah so I try to live by that quote. Um, favorite actor? I really like Mishka Hargitay from Law & Order SVU. Oh yeah, Law & Order SVU is another one of my favorite shows. Um, I don't know why I forgot that one because I really like that one. 
Um, favorite color. I don't really have a favorite color, but I quite like pink. It's a very lovely color. Um, loud music or soft? I think I would say soft music because like I can listen to music that's like loud for a bit, but I can't tolerate it for a long time. I get like a headache and it's just, loud music is just too loud. So soft music with the occasional loud music, I'd say. Um, where do you go when you're sad? I'm practically always in my apartment, so I guess I just stay in my apartment when I'm sad. Uh, how long does it take you to shower? It's actually been getting shorter in recent months, I've noticed. It used to take me 20 minutes. Um, it takes me like closer to 10 minutes now. Unless I have to shave my legs and it takes like loads longer because I'm really slow when I shave. Um, next question, 22. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Mm, I usually set my alarm clock for like an hour and a half before I have to leave the house. Um, it really only takes me about an hour to get ready, but I like to not be rushed in the morning and I like to have time to sit down and eat breakfast and like check my email and stuff and just sort of like, yeah, not be rushed. Um, so an hour and a half, but I can get ready in an hour. Ever been in a physical fight? Um, no, <laughs> I've never been in a physical fight except like I have three sisters and when I was younger, like we would always like fight each other and stuff, but you know, no one ever like got seriously hurt. What is, what are your turn ons? Um, I'm assuming this means like in a guy. Um, I'm really attracted to guys who are good with kids um, and guys who care about their health. So guys who are physically active, but the totally ripped guys who go to the gym like for hours every day, that's a turn off for me. So like I like them to like, you know, care about their physical health and also like their mental health, their spiritual health. Um, and also really be kind to other people, not just me, but everyone. Um, I don't know, I think this question is kind of similar to the question earlier about quality you look for in a partner. Um, so honesty, integrity. Um, I think guys who wear glasses are a big turn on because they just look so intellectual. Um, turn off. Guys who are cocky, cocky attitudes. I just can't handle it. Guys who think like they're all that, like it just irritates me. Um, guys who spend like every waking minute in the gym. Um, like it's great to care about, I don't know, your health, but I don't really find it that attractive when guys like are so focused on how they look. I don't know. I don't know if that makes sense. Um, other turn offs. Guys who badmouth other people in front of me. Because if they badmouth other people, how do I know that they're not going to turn around and badmouth someone else about me? You know? Um, I guess that goes back to the honesty thing. Like, I, I'm, I'm really, like, all about the honesty. Um, the reason I joined YouTube. I think I had just started taking Paxil for my anxiety. Or I was about to start taking it. I can't exactly remember anymore. And... At that time, I had recently found a few other people's channels that talked about um, their journey with social anxiety, um, and they were sort of like recording their progress towards becoming less socially anxious. And I had also found people's channels about their experience taking Paxil, so I thought that like it might be a good, it might be interesting for me to try that and see if I liked it, and I did, so I continued with it. Um, what are your fears? Mm, rejection. Um, being embarrassed in front of lots of people. Being lonely for the rest of my life. I say being lonely for the rest of my life is um, my biggest fear. Um, last thing that made you cry. I don't cry very often. Um, I think the last time I cried was in the beginning of July. Yeah, it was in the beginning of July. I had recently gotten my gallbladder removed at the end of June. And I had to be readmitted to the hospital because of really bad pain. I was back in the hospital like for, I don't know, five days I think. And yeah, I, I was crying just because I was in so much pain. Um... Last time you said you loved someone. I told my mom I loved her 
when I last emailed her, I think, three days ago. I gotta email my mom. I haven't talked to her in a long time. Question 30, meaning behind your YouTube name. Okay, so my YouTube name is Snowflake891000. Um, when I first joined YouTube, I, well, and even now, I found it really important to be anonymous. So I didn't want to put my name, I didn't want to put anything like really identifying about myself. And it was snowing at the time that I was setting up my channel. So I was thinking like along the lines of like snow and winter and cold. So I came up with Snowflake and then 89 is the year I was born. And 1000 are just a few more numbers that I tacked on to the end. Um, last book you read. I read, well, I don't really read. I listen to audiobooks. Um, but the last books I read were nursing textbooks. I have way too many of them. Um, the book that you're currently reading. It's not a very interesting book, but it is called Nursing Research in Canada. Um... Next question. Last show you watched. I watched the MasterChef, MasterChef finale. Last person you talked to. Um, wow, it's been a long time since I talked to anyone. Okay, so two days ago I was at my community nursing placement at a school. And so I talked to loads of people there. That was two days ago. Wow, it's been a long time since I talked to anybody. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. I don't know who I last texted. Let me check. Oh, my boss. She asked if I could babysit this evening. And I had to tell her no because I'm already babysitting someone else. Um, uh, what is your favorite food? I don't have a favorite food. But I do like ice cream. Place you went to visit. There are so many places I want to visit. Like Europe. Um, okay, if I had to be more specific than Europe, I would say Paris. Um, last place you were. Okay, so, okay, today I didn't go anywhere. Yesterday, I went to the computer store to pick up my computer, which I had been separated from for like four days or something, uh, because I was getting it fixed. Um, so I was really happy to go to the computer store yesterday to pick it up. So I have my computer back and it's all fixed and I'm happy again. Um, do you have a crush? Mm. I mean, sort of, but I tend to be, it's kind of odd, but I tend to be attracted to guys who are inaccessible. So like married men, teachers, Guys I see in the airport who, you know, I'll never cross paths with again, probably. Um, I do have a crush, but I don't know if he knows I exist. Um, last time you kissed someone. Um, well, I was home recently, and when I left, I kissed, I kissed everyone, but my mom was the last person that I kissed. Last time you were insulted. I don't know. I feel like I get insulted really easily, but I don't remember the last time that I was insulted, so maybe I'm really not insulted that often. I don't know. Um, favorite flavor of sweet? I don't know. Just anything sweet or like. What instruments do you play? I have never in my life played an instrument. I might be the only person in the world who's never played an instrument. But yeah, I don't even know how to read notes. Um... Favorite piece of jewelry? Uh, I don't know. I don't really wear jewelry that often. Um, besides my earrings. I have this ring. I don't know. You can't really tell, but it's like really tiny diamonds that I got in eighth grade. And I really like my fossil watch. Um, it's like really simple but I like simple. I don't like showy things. But I mean, I have like other jewelry, but I never really wear them. So I guess those aren't my favorites. So I guess my favorites are like a tie between my ring and my fossil watch. I don't know. Um, last sport you played. I also don't play sports. So no musical instruments 
No sports. <laughs> um, it's been a while, I think. I played soccer with some kids, but that was like, that was in Ireland in summer 2013. So it's been over a year, I guess. Last song you sing. <laughs> the um, Castle on a Cloud song from Les Miserables. Favorite chat up line. Mm, is a chat up line like a pickup line? Because if it's a pickup line, then I don't have a favorite. Like they're all dumb. Um, have you ever used it? I wouldn't use a pickup line ever. Last time you hung out with anyone. Yeah, see, I'm like a loner. So I don't hang out with people. So last time I hang out, hung out with someone, I don't know, like a lifetime ago probably. And who should, he, who should answer these questions next? Anybody who wants to. Bye guys.